situated in trance by means of intelligence thus the mind should be fixed on the self alone and should think of nothing else yeah. <clears throat> the self the mind should be fixed in self we are self and krishna is also self So, just like if you fix up your eyes on the sun, then you can see the sun and yourself also. Uh, sometimes in dense darkness, we cannot see ourselves also. That we have experienced. So I cannot see my body in dense darkness. Although body is with me, I am the body or I am whatever I am. I cannot see myself. That you have got experience. So if you are in the sun sign, sun light, then you see the sun as well as yourself. Is it not? Therefore, to see the self means first of all see the supreme self. The supreme self is Krishna, and the Vedas it is said, "Katho punisha nitta nityanam chetana chetana na." The supreme self uh, is the chief eternal of all eternals. He is the chief living being of all living beings. Uh, so this Krishna consciousness movement means to fix up in self. To the same example, if you fix up. Your mind in Krishna, then you can uh, fix up your mind in everything. The same example again. If you take care of your stomach, then you take care of all the bodily limbs. Uh, if your stomach is supplied. Nice, nutritious food. The stomach is clear of all disturbances. Then you keep good health. So, if you pour water in the root of the tree, then you take care of all the branches, leaves, flowers. Tweaks everything automatically. So if you take care of Krishna, then you do the best service to all others automatically. These boys, they are going to keep them party because they are Krishna conscious. It is not that they are sitting idly in this temple. They are going outside, preaching this philosophy, so that others may take advantage of it. So a Krishna conscious person cannot see it idly. He thinks that such a nice philosophy of life 
why it should not be distributed. That is his mission. Oh. A yogi may be satisfied with his own elevation. He is sitting in a secluded place practicing yoga, elevating himself to transcendental life. That is his personal concern. But a devotee is not satisfied simply elevating his self, his personal. We offer our respect to the Vaishnavas. Vancha kalpatal bhascha kripa asindu bhayevacha patitanam pavane bhya vaishnavi bhya namana. Vaishnav is he, devotee is he, who is very compassionate to these conditioned souls. Kripa asindu bhayevacha. Kripa means mercy, and Sindhu means ocean. A devotee is ocean of mercy. He wants to distribute the mercy. Just like Lord Jesus Christ, He was God conscious, Krishna conscious, but He was not satisfied in Himself. If He would have continued his God-consciousness alone, he would not have met a crucifixion. But, no, he wants to take care of others also. The others should be god Others should be krishna conscious. <coughs> he was forbidden by the king not to do that. So at the risk of his life, he did it. That is the nature of devotee. Therefore, the preacher devotee is the most dearest devotee of Lord. That is stated in the Bhagavad Gita. They are going outside, they are preaching, then meeting opposing elements. Oh, sometimes they are defeated. Sometimes disappointed, sometimes able to convince. There are different kinds of people. So, not that every devotee is very well equipped. There are three classes of devotees also. But that endeavor that I shall go and preach Krishna consciousness is the best service to the Lord. Because they are trying. Uh, in opposition to elevate people to the highest standard of self-realization. Uh, so one who has seen, one who is in trance of self-realization, he cannot see it idly. Uh, he must come out. Uh, he, just like Ramanujacharya, he declared the mantra publicly. His spiritual master said that this mantra, uh, just like uh, that Maharshi came in your country, he wanted to give some private mantra. If that mantra has any power, why it should be private? If at all the mantra has any why not it should be publicly declared so that everyone can take advantage of that mantra. That is real. It is cheating. You see. So here is no cheating process. We say that this Mahamantra can save you, we are distributing publicly. No confidence. Free, without any charge. But people are so fools, they are not prepared to take this. They will hanker up at that mantra after Mahasya. Pay thirty-five dollars, 
and take some private money. So people want to be cheated. And here Hare Krishna mantra, these people are preaching without any charge, declining in the street, park, everywhere, come on, take it. No, this is not good. This is maya. This is illusion. This is spell of maya. And if you charge something, if you bluff, if you cheat, our people will follow. Satcha bole to mare latha jhuta jagad bhulai. Danna kali jo duk lage haspal. This is a Hindu, Hindi verse. By one devotee, that this kali jo is so, uh, I mean, abominable. That if you speak truth, then people will come with some rod to beat you. But if you cheat them, bluff them, ah, they will be beat them. They will like it. If I say I am God, ah, people will say, oh, yes, son is God. They want to inquire so how you have become God. What is the symptom of God? Have you got all these symptoms? And nobody inquires. So, these things happen unless one is not fixed up in the self, unless one does not understand what is real self, unless one does not understand what is super self. So, Yoga means to understand this uh, self-realizing process. That is yoga. Wow. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna.